Testing one, two, three, one, two, three. Testing one, two, three, one, two. Testing. One, two, three. One, two, three. Testing one, two, three, one, two, three. Testing one, two, three, one, two, three. Testing one, two, three, one, two, three. Wasabi, everyone. This is Evil Twin Thirty Eight coming at you from Colorado. I decided to hop on and try to make another video, this time in Spelunky. It is one of my 
favorite games from the arcade back in the 360, and now that they have the emulator working, where you can play 360 games on the one, they can go back and play it. So let's get right down to it, and let's see how far we can get. So this is a hardcore game, meaning that if you die, you are permanently dead. And so you have to start all the way from the beginning. But there are shortcuts that you can make in order to make it so that you do not have to start at the very beginning. Um, I don't remember on this playthrough if I have any unlocked. Uh, see, I don't have any unlocked. They're up there. I guess we'll get right into it. The other door to the left, if you're wondering, is the tutorial. Um, which, you know, obviously would be pretty boring to go through right now. If you guys hear uh, dogs in the background, uh, it's my neighbor's dogs. They're howling away. There's nothing I can really do about it. But, you know, watch out for it. skeletons coming alive, spiders dropping from the ceiling, all kinds of stuff. Everything tries to kill you in this game. The good thing is that you pretty much climb on you. Object is to uh, rescue people. Fall damage too, which that kind of hurt. But alright. These boulder are each worth 500 for the small piles. Piles. But I could be wrong because I've picked up. Boxes. These are like the goodie bags of the game. The web gun, yes. Mega bombs. Basically, the web gun doesn't do a lot of damage, but it'll slow him down, so it'll get him trapped right there. Doesn't really do me much good. Have this. We'll just go to the next one. Uh, you guys unfortunately spawned in a little bit of a bad place. Alright. Big! That's Mario style, if you haven't noticed. You can just jump on their heads to kill them. Rather nice. You gotta watch out when you. Yes, uh, they could. I mean, um, fighters. What else spawns in them? Not, that. Not doing much for me right now. Ooh, you get over here, we're gonna push the rock as hard as we can. Okay, there we go. These guys will kill you a lot. They just shoot out those arrows. And those arrows will kill you pretty dead. Little rope up there using Y. Up here. Uh, That basically what it does, it's an artifact. It will actually show me what's hidden in the rocks. Um, you have to get, I believe there's three artifacts in this game. I haven't really, played, like, gotten, i played a lot, I just haven't really gotten that far in this game. City levels are pretty nasty. Spider. 
as you can see, there's a shopkeeper down there. Um, you can spend your gold down there and get some all kinds of nice goodies to upgrade you. Uh, dog, pig, whichever you have on. Here. So those ghosts you can't kill, um, there's a camera in the game that you can flash them with, but it just makes them close. Uh, one cool thing you might not know about this game is these spikes you can just walk right through them but if you jump on them then you'll die it's actually really nice so that you don't have to worry too much about getting somewhere and then all of a sudden you be dead because you walk through the spikes you make the jump box of bombs but you can only hold so many before you run out and we're dead all right one two the next maps are uh, randomly generated um i don't know how many different variations there are but it seems to be a lot because i usually don't end up uh, running into are the same You gotta watch it, even if you uh, throw something up, make the dark come out, or the arrow, it will bounce and hit you after it's hit the wall. It'll do the same amount of damage. One thing you gotta watch out for, because it gets you quite a lot if you just are trying to set off a trap and you just have to be in the ricochet of it. Hey, right there, perfect example. I almost died just from us. Not really exploring too much on these first couple maps because there's not really a lot to them except for the one artifact. Um, so generally it's not worth exploring it. Obviously you can get more gold. I have it on random, um, and uh, people to save. Well, it makes it a little more. You can see it's out of the same. I really like playing this game. It is fun. The furthest I've made it is to different part. The jetpack because the jetpack's awesome. Um, you can also rob the shopkeeper too, um, but generally it's not that very good of an idea because uh, he has a shotgun. Not prepared for it, he will just kill you. Probably take on a shopkeeper or two, too much, uh, especially once I get to the second part of the map. Um, it's really nasty on those maps. A lot more traps that can kill you. All around bad juju. Go the next map.
Here you can buy kiss. And kisses uh, give you lives. But when you save a princess, prince, dog, whatever you do. Um, they generally will have it so um, or so that you get a kiss, that way you can uh, move on. This is the treasure, so we'll get a still treasure. Wait, one. Oh, I wasn't high enough. Trying to jump as fast as I could, but it obviously did not work. Distracted a little bit right there. Um, so I was going crazy. So I just for some tear or oh. I get it. Not my dogs. Um, my friends. My friends. Through. I don't really see a reason why to uh, have it or to keep exploring on that map. I hear snakes! I hate snakes! Uh. Oh, bomb right there. Why not? Oh, work I wanted to. And treasure! Lots and lots of treasure! Oh, nice! Got a big axe. Awesome. Find the entire world with this. The only thing I don't like about this game is that you have to pretty much. I can either hold my pickaxe or this guy. to the next map. Look at Oh. I thought I got on the ladder, but obviously not. A fire. Great suggestion to have good stuff that you'll want. About oh, everything you buy from the shop in a crate. Whoosh!
bomb our way that way. You don't actually have to duck, it's not like shrapnel's gonna come at you. Careful because you can kill them on accident. Uh, so, you might want to watch it sometime. She probably has one good hit left, and then she will be dead. A little bit more cautious. Alright, fall. So my videos, so advice on how I can make it better. Um, I'll be buying a better mic because my mics on.
Um, I just thought I'm recording this at one in the morning, and I just heard someone knock on my door. So, yeah, I seemed a little uh, freaked out. That's why. Um, no clue who it was. They oh, ran off. So. Saving damsel or dams do call the guy in distress. All that. Good. Now. Gloves are probably my favorite because uh, they allow you to stick to the walls. So if you need to get back up, like if I wanted to get back up and grab that, um, that bit of uh, a treasure, I easily could. So it sits off that. That one. Oh, it doesn't work. That way. Here. Let's go grab that treasure. Um, I don't know where the key was. I actually did not see it. Let's climb back up. Grab the treasure real quick. Oh, spider! I did not see that spider coming, <laughs> even though I did see it at the start of the map. Um, I had forgotten it was there with all the excitement going on here. Fuck. Ready to start off this map? Falling to my doom. These crates are mainly what I look out for, more so than anything else. Generally, they contain really good items. I miss. I have killed. I died. Don't be afraid to use them as monster killers every once in a while. Comes in handy sometimes if you don't have to have a rocket. Oh, that trap got me. I only have one life, so we're just gonna roll out here. All right, on to the next one. Dash two. Arms just in case Want. Oh, nice. I mean, I meant to kill that skeleton. Yeah. Only what I had planned was to hang off the cliff and drop the This one, you wouldn't be able to jump that. Well, you could jump down here and jump it. I don't have to. Walk across it. I don't know if I set off this one. Dog.
Uh, uh. about this game is that everything gets affected by spikes. So that scorpion, I just want spikes and I win. Not even standard jets. Boss. And we're dead. Again. Right, come on, we got this. Down. Get around it, and then all of a sudden, it was like, oh, surprise. this gold bar and then the dog rename the dog and fluffy for now got fluffy we're gonna take fluffy over to the exit real quick anyway, since it's bag there Did me near you. You love me, right? And on to the next one. Hey. As you saw before, these giant spiders can be real easy. Tap them in a nice spot and you just bounce on there easily. But they also. Grab this again. Cut up. Oh, I forgot that it went right. Came back up. 
got really lucky on that one. Uh, definitely knocked out all my health, though. And the fall killed me. <laughs> what a way to go. Long fall! I broke every bone in my body. We give it one more try. And uh, I think we'll call it a day on Splunky. Um, this is a co-op game, um, but it's only local co-op, which is kind of a letdown. And I normally I would actually have my best friend Robo Jelly Bean X5 or my twin sister Pixie Cat playing with me on these. Um, but currently I am in Colorado and they are in. by myself. Okay, this game's still really fun by yourself, but, you know, everything's a lot more fun to play with other people on the couch or whatever, um, just hanging out. Like I said, sometimes our jobs just kind of keep us away from it. I want that chest. Not uh, worth Oops. That spider. Probably meant to do that also. Uh, it's only missing. I didn't even bother with over there. To be or not to be. I don't know how many people I actually know that have actually read Shakespeare. Um, I remember reading it back in high school in my classes, but. Other than that, I've never actually read it, or very even been through the place for it, really. Lots of treasure, but I think I'm going to pass on the treasure this time. I have been making a couple mistakes, I just want to see how far we can get. Uh, chapter 2. Uh, nice. I almost ended badly. <laughs> I did not think that one through. Up her off. Fighter. Oh. Go for the random gift. Oh, let's do the mystery box. What could it be? And spectacles. Once again, spectacles also allows allow you to be able to see. Thought there was more. Obviously not. Oh, oh honey, I miss you. Smoochy smoochy. Alright, let's go. is a sacrifice chamber. You can take survivors and put them on here and an evil god guy will give you a reward. Or, uh, Alright. Anyways, we'll give you an award for um, sacrificing I was going to show you guys kills are great in this game. That much now because I am going to be Oh, and there's a caveman right there. Pickaxe. 
probably be more beneficial than the dog would anyways. There, there. I actually don't understand why that just exists. Um, I, I don't know if they're proximity lines or what they are. I seem to do that every once in a while, they just randomly explode. That. Spider. On to the next one. I don't know if you guys like looking at those stats or not. Um, if you do, leave a comment below. And I will slow down and uh, see what my stats are. Generally, not a lot of people uh, play this game anymore. So, I just wanted to play it and record it. So. As I said, if you. Uh, like those kinds of stats and everything, just let me know. Not a bit. Okay, so you guys can see them. Over here, please. Now, thankfully, when I cut out that emerald, um, we were able to set up that trap. I don't think it matters anyway, so I can actually pass the trap. Grab this guy. Ooh, we might actually make it. I think it's... Oh, yep, right here. So this guy, he's creates all the shortcuts. So you have to have a bomb, a rope, and then some money. Um, so I've already given him a bomb, and unfortunately I don't have a rope to give him. So, like, I won't be able to work on the shortcut this time around. So this is map number two. This is the jump. Now here, this place is a lot more deadly. And the cave. Totem spikes everywhere. Monkeys. Everything here just wants to kill you. It will. shoes I believe um, add damage to jumping on enemies so like, regular spider or something like that. Anyways, if you run into an enormous spider and it uh, handy but I don't remember if you actually see ginormous spiders or not up over here and we'll grab this ruby. Oh. That. Oh, looks like my pickaxe broke. Um, I actually did not know that you could break. Um, I actually have bad luck when I have them, so. Generally. Guy to face away from us because he's got that boomerang. 
that. Next part. You want to see my stats so far? Um, powers on these maps are sometimes really short. But other times they're just. Was it possible to get to? Um, we just lost our. This is being fly traps. Will eat you. Uh, there's different kinds of frogs. There's these blue ones that are just regular, and there's red ones that will actually explode when you hit them. You can actually use them as dynamite if you plan it right, and you can actually get through levels. Not like, uh, you know, if I wanted to get, you know, from up here to down there, I, all I'd do is. Um, you hit a red one and open it up. Best of us. That caveman is. This is one of the exploding ones. Pinkies will jump on your back and steal your gold, um, and they will throw it out once they steal it. I was devoured by a mantra. Alright, well, thank you so much for watching, um, sorry I was a little distracted, uh, with someone showing up at my door at 1 in the morning. But anyways, if you like the video, please leave a thumbs up, leave comments below. Um, let me know how I can improve. Obviously, the audio quality is not going to be the best right now um, because my mic actually went out today when I decided to start recording YouTube videos. Um, so I do all my YouTube video recordings right now through Twitch at uh, twitch.tv slash eviltwins88, all one word. Um, you can check me out there. You can watch me recording them. Uh, generally, if I'm recording a YouTube video, I won't reply to the comments um, through, like, verbally, but I will type on my laptop to you and respond. Anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.